Everybody, Warframe on mobile is here. And with the introduction of Warframe Mobile was a lot of drama, surprisingly. And I'd say there's around three layers to this drama. First is Warframe Mobile players and Warframe Mobile introduction added a ton of people spamming and flaming the general Warframe region chat and like uh, trade chat with nothing relevant. So, hey, one piece of drama. Second is Warframe iOS is on only on iOS. So Android players are pissed off and a lot of people, Android players are like flaming Warframe for not having anything on Androids anytime soon. Cause if you didn't know, Warframe Android is in beta, but it, Warframe Android is not coming out as a full release anytime soon. And then the third layer was people complaining about how bad performance was on mobile, mobile only being 30 FPS, and how buggy it was. I think your fourth ability in Warframe Mobile just straight up wasn't usable for a while, so... God damn it, what even is Warframe Mobile? Straight up, like, not even playable. And a lot of people are having their performance issues, so they're flaming Warframe. So that looks like the Warframe mobile drama right now. That being said, let's look around at the comments across YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, no, mainly YouTube, mainly Reddit, and Warframe iOS reviews, because it's in the iOS store, which means there are public reviews for it. So, let's take a look. Warframe Mobile is the entirety of Warframe. It is cross-playable with PC, with uh, PlayStation, Xbox, and Switch, so, yeah. That's the Warframe Mobile iOS trailer playing in the background, right? Solid trailer. Post migrations are gonna be brutal, and they are. Turning our phones into ovens, secret boss fight, phones catching fire, nice, nice. Everyone's like, oh God, oh God. Good trailer, grind never stops. I've been waiting, thank you, right? A lot of people are like happy, hoping Android version will be ready soon, but there are a lot of comments that are flaming them for not having the Android version out yet. I don't know what kind of an optimization they did, but like, what? Crazy, right? I hope mobile players won't have an opportunity to be host. That terrifies me. The chance that a goddamn Warframe mobile player might be my host is sounds terrifying, but at the same time, like Warframe mobile players could have really good Wi-Fi or really good internet. So you never know, right? You never know. <laughs> a lot of people are like me. <laughs> Meanwhile, me on PC. Joining a host playing on Starbucks Wi-Fi. Hell yeah. What about us Android users? The TLDR is soon. I think Warframe, like Warframe themselves said during the stream that like essentially it's just easier to do and or iOS first because Apple has less variation, right? It's Apple, it's all iOS, so yeah, but the Android's coming up. It'll take time, but it's coming up, so keep that in mind. Just in time for winter, right? Do you guys not have phones? Keep up with Kuma Brahma, okay. And then a lot of people are just like, yeah, okay, cool, nice, awesome, but what about Android? Cool, awesome, Android, question mark? Bluetooth controller? You should be able to use controllers with it, so that's pretty cool. Even on my video, I've had a ton of people commenting, right? Two hour Cascadia, taking a poo. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, we're all gonna be pooing playing Warframe. Imagine getting an Android ready for your message like, hi, from a Samsung fridge. Started playing on my iPhone 14. Seems to play pretty well so far. Graphics are better than the Switch. Hell yeah, brother. We did it. Graphics are better than Switch. Cross save on iOS not working for me. Redirects to my iOS account after MR0. He may have not set it up right, or it could be broken. I need it on Android. It's the driving reason I get mobile controller for my phone. Fair enough. Just not out yet. I'm in the region chat, guys, and he was talking... It was cool. <laughs> nice. Now we need Warframe on VR, right? Connecting for a few hours, no progress. Ooh, their app hasn't been able to work, right? Technically not. <clears throat> really buggy on the layout for iPad Pro. On iPhone, it seems so far good. Okay, that's good. FPS caps reduce stuttering. I think it's always aiming for 120 FPS. Oh dear God, maybe not. All right, average mass storage it takes. You should allow us to move Warframe left to right in the reticle HUD. Okay, okay, fair enough. Samsung users hurting from this. Yeah, but I've gotten a lot of comments that are just like, hey, F you, where's, where's Android? You ain't seen nothing yet. Main Android v or Warframe VR. Feels like shit to play. Games run well. Oh, that's so funny. 
Oh, Boba allows your ADS to jump the movement choice to stop moving. Yeah, yeah. Can you change your alias? No, not if you set up the do 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 cross save. So it's not on Android, which has better specs. <laughs> can someone please use some cord on Android? Yeah, customize orbiter. I can finally touch grass while playing Warframe. Yes! And then people are just like, yeah, okay, Warframe Mobile is doing good. It's doing poorly. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Some people are liking it. This person not able to log in, right? It seems like the general consensus around the idea of Warframe Mobile is it's working well for some people. And for other people, it's not working so well. Not able to connect right now. Ooh, right? Cross is not working. Yeah, a lot of issues there. But Warframe Mobile is on the iOS store. And you know what that means? Yeah, Warframe Digital Extremes. They temporarily took down the companion app so you can only Warframe download the normal Warframe app. It has number two in role playing and it's only being beaten out by goddamn Outlet Rush. So if you're on iOS, you better go goddamn download Warframe right now so it can beat Outlet Rush. And if you don't, I will come find you and judge you. Also, you better subscribe, like, comment down below, and use the Epic Games creator code Pupsker if you ever use the Epic Game Store, Fortnite or not, because that is the way it'd be. So there are a lot of ratings. It has four stars overall, okay? 2.4K ratings, and we can now see the ratings. They were private before and they're public now. Oh, I can only see like 10 public ones. Damn. So the one that's one star, garbage, lacks basic mobile features. Oh, damn, okay. Yeah, no ability to change display, okay, okay. Tweak stuff, terrible UI, bad. No, locked at 30 to 60, okay. Unable to even change menu, of UI, buggy chat boxes, list goes on, meant to be played with controller. So this person, clearly not having a good time. And clearly like a lot of people are one star reviewing it, so it's not like it's doing great. But yeah, people, and then everyone else is schmoozing like, oh, it's doing great. I can't believe this is the entire game. It's such a small download. Oh, good job, Warframe, right? It's not perfect, but you know, they did well. A lot, a lot of it's like four star <laughs> reviews because like clearly five star. It's not perfect at all, but they're working on it. So good for Warframe. A lot of the reviews are, you know, positive overall. Positive overall. Uh, no, if you use my code for free games, I don't think so. I just get cool look at it. And then there's the entirety Warframe iOS update patch launch where people can check it out, right? A lot of people are like, what? Whoa, cross save. Nice, nice, awesome. Performance disappointing on iPhone Pro Max 15. Nice. Well, I guess not nice, but... <clears throat> Is there a list of iOS available countries? I've seen reports of Russia being excluded. I think Russia's been unplayable for Warframe for like a year, half a year. Yeah. Either way, yeah. Do, do, do. Brazil's also excluded. No. People are getting login failed. Can't log in. UI seems bugged. Oh, no. <laughs> Shit. Can't log in. So, you know, there's still, still clearly issues. It's gotten a lot better now, though. But still... Yeah, the drama's not terrible, luckily. I think they're going for a nostalgia or athlete experience playing closed beta, Warframe Mobile, iPhone 15 Plus. If you're curious how it looks, not bad. Here's the user on Reddit, Fart Tart. Nice. Okay, okay. Why are you stalking me, bro? Mark for test stalker. Ugh. Average net shell teammate be like, dog, my net shell teammate is going to be on this. Solar disable cross save, please. Oh, people are scared. It's like, look at this. <laughs> it's like really slow gameplay, right? comparative to Warframe, but it's also the first mission, so it's not like you could do anything else. So yeah, Natchez L teammates, no, runs like shit on my iPhone 12 Pro Max. Yeah, makes sense. Fine for me, runs good enough, not bad. First game out, poor phone, confirm not won't work on iPhone 6S. Yeah, too old. Stuttering looks horrible, FPS is bad, better performance than Switch at least, lol. Okay, hilarious. Happy that his teammates have caught on solo carry on content. Damn, it's gonna be hilarious seeing Mission Region even more hilarious. Glad I didn't enable crossplay. <laughs> oh my god. Everyone's just roasting the iPhone players. Oh my god. I was gonna say, don't understand why I release games. So, plus, no, 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 no. answer that question most often money. Yeah, people like money. Can you use your PC dad? So, everyone's, yeah, a lot, ton of people flaming them on Reddit. Holy shit. Damn, dude. It has 102 comments and only 356 update votes, with, I think, the most upvoted comment. Almost ratioing the entire post. Holy shit. 
So it looks like Reddit is uh, angry at mobile. If you ever felt dumb in a game, let me tell you that I'm so used to predating mo mobile games that after five days of playing, I realized that you can craft more than one item at a time at a forge. I thought this was funny. That's all. That's it. You can also use the forge as a storage. I think people probably mentioned this here. Yeah, like here. That's, and I just thought that was funny. That's all. Shit's hilarious. And it's a mobile game, boys. We're playing a Warframe mobile game. Last but not least, seems like a mistake to allow IS players to be hosts. Yeah, I don't think it's a matter of when phone hardware can handle Warframe. And then a lot of people are talking about it. It's like, just hoping there's some way that I can opt out of it. iOS, there isn't. It's either crossplay on or off. And then they're talking about ping. Yeah, it's about opting out crossplay, this reason only. Don't mind playing with mobile, but not for unstable connection. Fair. Just switch off crossplay platform on my mobile account. Yeah, or on my account. Fair enough. I think it's a simple check. Their Wi Fi should be on the minimum. Data. Yeah, 5G. Mobile. Yep. Okay, I mean, I'm only going to use my phone to get daily login rewards, so now would be a good time to improve our matchmaking system. Yeah. So, as you can see, the drama around Warframe Mobile is not terrible. I got a lot of random comments of people just being pissed off it wasn't on Android. A lot of random comments of people being pissed off the performance wasn't good or it didn't work on their iPhone because it was too old, stuff like that. But it's some casual Warframe drama. There's a lot of goofy drama going on right now in games in regards to stuff like that so hey we did it warframe folk we did it we have warframe mobile it's working it's not perfect there's a little bit of people who are pissed off but hey it is what it is either way sub like use epic games creator code pupsker and check out all of my social medias comments and everything in the description below yeah cheers, cheers.